Hey guys, what is going on? It is Overkill here with another video for GTA 5, some leaks and some stuff like that. But before the video, I want to kind of tell y'all why we haven't been uploading videos and having a persistent schedule. Um, my Elgato software on my computer was not responding and doing all this weird stuff. So I asked Elgato so, uh, support, and they're really cool guys. Don't be afraid to ask them anything. They gave me some help, but I didn't really use what they told me. I just kind of left it alone because I was getting ready for school and all that. And uh, it just kind of fixed itself, so now I'm able to record and getting all this stuff. Jonathan is going to be recording really soon, and we're going to be putting out, out videos, I guess, like one or two a week. So, uh, yeah, and another thing... After my Elgato software stopped, like, working, basically, I uh, I was getting ready for school and band and athletics and all that stuff, so I was really busy, and that's another reason why we haven't been uploading lately, because school just started for us. So, yeah, getting into the video, you can probably tell by the title that this is going to be about the heist and all the leaks and stuff that are kind of confirming some of the stuff in the heist. So the first thing we have here, it was found in the coating and also in a picture. It's the thermite bomb. If you don't know what a thermite bomb is, it's actually a bomb that uh, melts metal. So it can melt the metal for, you know, for the money vaults and stuff, melt the doors and stuff. Basically, that's kind of what you can conclude from that, just thinking, man, that could be melting the vaults. Um, and also, the thermite bomb is a time bomb. It's a time bomb that melts metal. So if you think about that, you're thinking... That's going to be, that should be in the heist, you know? So, time bomb that can melt the vaults, that has to be in the heist. And another pretty much determining factor that this is in the game is that, do y'all remember that uh, kind of glitch for, like, I think it was last week or so when Flight School came out? Uh, you didn't have your musket. They accidentally took the musket out of the game when they were updating the game for Flight School. And there's this picture on, I think, the Newswire or the forums that shows all the guns that are in the game. And uh, when the musket wasn't on there, that's how they could tell that um, it was out of the game. So when they cropped the musket, because, you know, there's also weapons on there that we don't know about. And so they had to crop just the musket. And when they put it there, there's actually a little part of a l other device-looking thing that they didn't crop out that's on the picture. And if you look, there's a leaked photo that shows this bomb that's parallel w at the top of the musket, and if you look at the picture that they didn't crop on the newswire and all the forums, there's actually a piece of that, and it's super identical. It's right there, so that's pretty much a determined factor that that is going to be in the game. These heists might be coming out in one to three updates, so you'll be looking for that in the heists. Next thing I want to talk about is the LS Custom Customizations. The same guy that found the thermite bomb stuff went and is a, like a coding searcher. He went to the coding for LS Customs, you know, and like the the way the the customization stuff works is when you go into Los Santos Customs and say you want to get wheels and you click wheels well behind the scenes in the servers and in the game and stuff it is like asking itself questions has this like server or this account downloaded the independence update has it downloaded the flight school update it asks for all the updates and if you have those updates it um it shows up you know whatever customization you want and you you're able to click it but it's asking itself about those updates and um so this guy went to the coding and he actually looked under wheels and he saw like the little coding and it said um, it was searching for and it said looking for so and so MP update. I'm not sure if it said heist on it. I think it might have said heist on it. So there's some heist searching coming and there's going to be some customizations. If you, and if you think about heists and wheel customizations, um, usually you would I, I would think about you know those spiky tires like on the little hubcaps where you can like ram into the side of someone's car and it could pop their tire or hurt damage their car at all and also if you think maybe there might be a heist in North Yankton or so and you can get chain wheels you know how you get chain wheels in snow to go faster and be able to accompany that snow so maybe there's a chain wheel upgrade and if you think about that if they're coming out with wheel upgrades they're gonna be have to coming uh coming out with some kind of armor upgrades like bulletproof armor that's gonna be really expensive for you to uh, buy for your car you know if you think about heist and all that stuff that's that'll be really awesome with that thermite bomb and um another thing I wanted to talk about um there's actually you know the five character slots you know, most we can only have two right now, but there's actually five character slots. And there's a leak that they're saying that they're going to be unlocking all five character slots. And personally for me, I'm just going to be using my one character. But maybe for like the heist and stuff, if I want to jack around or I want one character to be super strong, one character to be super stealthy, another character to be agile, or another character to be like super good at shooting, 
maybe I could do that if I wanted to, but I think I'm just going to stick with my normal character because I'm level 167. I have everything unlocked. It's just so much progress that I don't want to lose by starting over with another character, especially when the heists are coming out. So, guys, just tell me in the comments what y'all think about these new character slots, what y'all think about the Thermite Time Bomb, and what you think about these new wheel customizations. Give me some suggestions of what y'all would like to see in the game and what you think would be in the game and be awesome for these heists. Um... As I said again, I'm probably not going to be using these character slots. Y'all might use the character slots. Just tell me y'all's opinion. I love hearing what y'all have to say about the community, guys. And remember, this channel is not just GTA 5, but right now with the heist leaks and stuff, there's a lot of awesome information that I wanted to get out there for y'all guys. And if y'all stay tuned, we will have a uh, money glitch coming out that I've gotten a lot of money on, about a million dollars. Because I only did it for a couple days. But uh, we'll be having a money glitch coming out. There's going to be all sorts of games that we're recording. Right now it's just GTA 5 because of the heist. So um, guys, go ahead and like this video and subscribe to the channel. Subscribing just gives you a notification saying when we're live. It doesn't even give you a notification. It just shows up on your phone that you're subscribed. Well, go ahead and uh, like the video, subscribe, and go follow us on Twitter for news and updates. Guys, thanks for watching and peace out. See ya.